What an amazing audience. Yeah, see? It's taken so long, but I'm glad you're here now. I just am a huge fan. Thank you. Huge, huge fan. Thank you very much. Now, uh, let's talk about uh, the most powerful, is it, what, what were you on Time Magazine, most powerful man in the universe or something yes, like that? Yes, that's exactly right. Mm -hmm. I was most powerful. I was in that most influential people of the year thing, and, but what do polls mean? I was, I was voted um, man most women secretly fancy. That's the recent one, right? Yeah. <laughs> well, no, no, no. That's, that's not a good thing. That's not a compliment. Because that means, if it's secretly fancy, that means they're ashamed of it. I, 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 why, why do they even admit it? I mean, how did they get it out of them? Who do you fancy? Was it under interrogation? Was it like Jack Bauer saying, who do you fancy? OK, it's Ricky Gervais. It's, it's, why, why make it a secret? <laughs> but they, but the, nonetheless, they fancy you. Yeah, I don't know who these people are. They, yeah. <laughs> They don't get out enough. I don't know. I think more people just need to, to know more about you because uh, I fancy you. I think you're absolutely brilliant and hilarious. Thank you and very much. And you, you must know that about yourself. Now, I'm impressed with that. Now, good. That you fancy me. I'll come out and say it. <laughs> <laughs> I won't be closeted about that at all. I will tell you right now. That's how I feel about you. Um, I, I'm proud of that. Yeah. Because you are very... And in this movie, and you wrote it, so obviously you wrote these lines to say, you make fun of your weight, you make fun of your, your looks, you make fun of all kinds of things about yourself in the, in the film. Why? Well, well, because unlike this show, with a lovely audience and you're being gracious, most people... They want to say it anyway, so I try and get it in before them. Mm -hmm. So it, it pulls the rope. So, you know, if I walk down the street usually and they're shouting, hey, you loser, you fat, so I get it out there before them. Who's see, yelling so. that at you? Who's, who's saying you loser as you walk down the street? Well, maybe they're not, but... <laughs> in your head? In my head, they're saying it. Uh -huh. They're thinking it. Yeah, because the whole thing with you and Jennifer Garner, I love the movie, by the way. It's, it's hilarious and, and smart and just, uh, it's just oh, thank you. really, really clever. But, uh, you know, Jennifer Garner is, plays someone you're interested in and it's just tearing yes, you apart. Yes, I mean, it's a world where the human race hasn't evolved the gene for lying, so everyone tells the absolute truth. And um, it's their nature. I mean, they say things like, oh, your baby's so ugly. <laughs> and... And, um, you know, so I get beaten up. They, they tell me I'm a little fat loser and everything. And, um, uh, and, but then I discover I can lie. So now the shoe's on the other foot. Now it's like a superpower. So people believe everything I say. Yeah. So I can do anything I want. So, it's uh, really beautiful, too, when you start lying. It's a very touching scene. Yeah. It is. It, it is. No, it, it is. Because it's a weird it, time that he starts... Uh, oh, no, it's the second time you lie with your mother. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, yes, when my mother's dying in the scene. It goes from sort of comedy to drama, and there's mm -hmm. some big questions about, you know, life and death and mm -hmm. all that. I mean, it's, it's not just a comedy. But, um, uh, you know... It, Are you a liar? Um, every day. <laughs> So that's honest. I, th I think of myself, and doing this film, I realise that I'm, a, I'm an honest person when it counts, but I tell those white lies that I lie every day when someone says, oh, can you come to my baby's christening? And, you know, I'd rather be at home drunk in my pants. <laughs> that's honest. I mean, I usually am when the phone goes. Uh -huh. I mean, um, <laughs> but I say things like, oh, I'm really too busy. They say, what are you doing? I go, giving blood at the orphanage. <laughs> Because I don't want to say the truth. No, I don't like you enough. I don't want to spend five hours with you and your family. I'm going home and taking my trousers off and drinking so, wine. So when you haven't been here, is it because you really couldn't be here, or...? No. I, I was giving blood at the orphanage. Oh, OK. All right. I mean, I'm running out of blood. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but that's what I love about this film, because it really is that, like, that honest... Uh, to, to be able to say, I don't really care for you that much to spend that much time with but you. It's, it, the, the, the first half of the film is obviously you're laughing at these people saying these brutally honest things to me, but then the second half, you're enjoying what I can do with the lies and what I can get away yeah. with. Um, and then, as I say, it moves into more dramatic yeah. territory because he, he says one lie that gets 
sort of taken up and it changes the world. So now yeah. I've got to live with it. So yes, it I, does. I don't want to give anything away. No, it's really, it's, it's very, very smart. Uh, you had a band, is that correct, in the 80s? Was it the 80s? Right. Like Wham? See, see I wish it was just pictures of me at home in my pants with a... <laughs> yes, I did. It was a long time ago. It was a long time ago. Yeah, it was when? 80... 80... Three, four. Okay, well, let's show the first one. Um, look at that. <laughs> look at that. Yeah. Very, that, that modern... Oh, God, <laughs> modern English kind of feeling, right? Yeah. You look like the guy from Modern English. That, it, it's, a, it's a very specific pop yeah. band see, look. Yeah, after that video was shot, I... Discovered pizza. <laughs> I said, movie. right, yeah, I said, but, right, I've got that on film. Uh -huh. Right, let's eat. <laughs> let's eat That's now it. for the next 20 years. Uh -huh.